Hi Capricorns, it's Jodie. I'm going to be giving you your month ahead reading with regards to love. Um, I'm using my Golden Universal Tarot deck, my favourite deck. Um, so let's see what we get. So what is Capricorn to expect um, within regards to love this month, please? What's going to be happening with Capricorn with love? Okay, first card, we've got the chariot. <clears throat> Way too many cards. That was basically the whole deck, nearly, bar one card. Okay, <clears throat> Capricorn. What is Capricorn to expect this month within love? Okay, so Capricorn, we've got the Chariot card, we have got the Six of Swords, the Hermit card, and the Page of Pentacles. Okay, so <clears throat> what I'm picking up on straight away, Capricorn, is with the Chariot card, this card represents balance and it re represents moving forward at a steady pace. Now I feel this is you within yourself. Um, I feel that you're gonna you're gonna feel balanced um, emotionally, and <clears throat> things with somebody else are gonna be moving forward this month. Um, <clears throat> try not um, through this month to move forward with um, thoughts or feelings. Um, of things that have already happened so things from the past try to stay in the present moment this month um, because you don't want to be moving forward um, with things that have already happened um, now whether you're in a partnership or not do continue to stay emotionally stable and balanced because it's very very important this month now, with the Hermit card here, um, I feel that this indicates somebody else. I feel that this month they may go into a bit of a Hermit mode. They may need some time to, to go within and to, 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 to introspect um, within themselves. Now, this isn't a bad thing. So, whether your partner or love interests seems to go... Um, maybe into a bit of a hermit mode. This is nothing to be concerned with. Um, they're going to come back and they're going to come back um, feeling um, more stable, um, especially um, with um, physical things and material things. Um, so it's kind of like they're not going um, within for, for their emotions. Um, they're going within to find out what it is of how they can improve um, maybe the home or a car or finances um, and they're going to come out of this mode feeling a lot more positive. Um, so it's not something that I generally say that you should be worried about. Now, is there anything else that Capricorn should know, especially regarding the Hermit? Okay, so we've got the Nine of Swords. So they are feeling a bit mentally overwhelmed um, and they do need this time. Um, they may need a bit of space and I would recommend to you to give them this because they need it right now. Um, and it's only for improvement, whether it's for the both of you or for themselves. This They need to do this and they're going to be coming out feeling a lot better so it's not something I'd be too concerned with. Now, I'm going to pull you a card from my Romance Angels and we'll see what we get. So, 
also any messages please for Capricorn for the month of March is there anything that Capricorn should know any messages please Okay, we've got keep an open mind. Um, your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. So obviously, if you're not already within a partnership, this is for people that are either looking for love or already have a love interest. And this card is telling you to keep an open mind. So this is your message. Now, what I'm also... Um, being urged to tell you alongside this card is do not bring the past with you keep moving forward keep staying stable and balanced um, this is very very important and keep an open mind so i hope you've enjoyed the reading please do subscribe and i'll be back on monday or tuesday for your week ahead reading bye for now capricorns